The government targets to enroll half a million elderly persons to the Anua Jami program in the next one month beginning September 1, 2023. This was revealed by the Social Protection Cabinet Secretary Florence Bori during a food donation exercise in Thika where over 6,000 elderly persons, PWDs and young mothers received food rations a mattress and a blanket each. The program which includes senior citizens, persons living with disabilities and vulnerable households, is meant to ensure that every member of the vulnerable groups is cushioned by the government. <laughs> tutaongeza kwa hiyo program na tumepewa directions kwamba watu nusu milioni tutaongeza kwa hiyo program kutoka tarehe moja mwezi mwezi wa tisa. wale ambao wanahitaji support pengine hawana wazazi na wale wako wale mavu wanahitaji support wataweka kwa hiyo program so kila constituency kwa hii Kenya mzima watakai wataingia kwa hiyo program tukiongeza nusu milioni hii mwaka Kenya mzima mwaka ujao tutaongeza pengine pengine uh, elfu mia saba onto the program because tunataka baada ya miezi mbili tukue tumaongeza one point three Kenyans into the social program or into the Inua program, the Inua Jami. Single mothers and wow muko hapu. Nile kazi tutakuja fanya na mweshimiwa, tunataka mujisima mie. Mweze kuchukua tuto enyu shule. Mweze kushugulikia yeshara zenu. Nyo mweze kusimama vizuri. Area MP Alice Ngangar urged her constituents to turn up in large numbers when the exercise kicks off. She warned that she would not tolerate anyone who took advantage of the exercise to solicit bribes from the beneficiaries saying that tough disciplinary action will be taken against the culprits. She added that the government planned to recruit health workers who would be taking care of the elderly persons in a health outreach program aimed at decongesting the available hospitals. The legislator also asked young mothers to organize themselves into groups that would later be funded by the government to enable them start income generating activities wale ambao wajaji sajiri first of september tunakuja kuangalia wale wamefikisha 70 years awako kwa inua jamii wale ambao wako total orphans hawana wazazi tunakuja kuwasajili tena wale ambao tunaita person living with disability severe disability pia au tunakuja kufanya recruitment ndio by the time mwezi taisha wa tisa waziri na ministry yake warudishe pamoja ndio wale wengine wakipata pesa pia wale ambao wanajiadikisha kwa wakati huu watakuwa wanapata hizo pesa tunaajiri health officers ambao watakuwa wanaenda kule leshaji kule machinani kabisa health officer mmoja atasimamia nyumba mia moja kazi yake kuanzia date one to date that first ni kwenda tu kule kuangalia vile wazazi wako rather hospitali ziwe zimejaa na mtu amegoteka homa yake imarimiziwa kwa nyumba rather mzazi atoke huko kiganjo akuje level 5 kwa sababu ya pressure tunamalizia hiyo maneno kule mashinani young mothers mwende mshikane watu kumi kumi tuanzishe biashara biashara hata akiwa ni ya kuchinja kuku nao biashara hata akiwa ni ya kibanda bado ni biashara iwe nini iwe nini ndio so that you can be able to empower you so that you can be able to empower your children. Raisi amesema ya kwamba kila yoyote ambao amefikisha miaka sabini aingie kwa hii mradi. Wale wako na severe disability waingie ndani. Wale ambao ni watoto tunaita kwa kiingereza total orphans, wale ambao hawana mami na wana dadi, pia au tunawaingisha kwa program. Ndio serikali kuu iweze kuangalia. 
hii exercise by the time tutakuwa tunafunga tarehe 30 mwezi wa tisa wewe ambayo ujakuwa captured ongea tunawakujia nyinyi wote hakuna hata mmoja tunabaki nyuma na hakuna dururu na ukisikia mtu mtuambie ndio tuwachukulie hatua kali and the government of Kenya through Dr. William Samoy Ruto our president has said we are going to start a program where we are going to have healthy officers who will be going to villages to houses checking care and taking care of this elderly instead of them coming to Thika level 5 or Makongeni or Gatwanyaga for checkup now checkup will be done at home and there will be a book when the clinical officer visits will be writing down their details their BP when it was taken, their sugar levels. And with this one, we are going even to reduce the number of people who are hospitalized. Every healthy officer is going to be allocated 100 homes, where that is where they'll be working from Jan uh, January to December.